Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you how to achieve this hair. It's called overnight curls and it's literally the easiest thing that I've ever tried. The first thing you're going to do is brush off the knots from your hair. Thereafter, you're going to take a hairbrush and damp the hairbrush and run the brush through your hair in order for your hair to get a little bit damp. Once you're done with that, make sure you section your hair into whichever part you want. I did a center part. So then after that, you're going to take your rope. I used the rope from one of my formal pants. So I took the rope and as you can see, I placed it on my head. And I took a piece of hair and I wrapped it, grabbed another piece of hair, wrapped it, grabbed another piece of hair and wrapped it. You continue doing that and thereafter you're going to take it and tie it at the, you're going to take it and tie it at the bottom so that it does not open thereafter we tackle the next side of your hair and you do the exact same thing take a piece round take the piece go around once you're done with that tie it at the bottom and so guys that's it you're gonna go to bed so i woke up and i went straight into the shower did my makeup and then i came to undo my hair Thereafter, I opened up the bands at the end of the hair and then I, I removed the curls from the band. And I opened it up and then you're just going to have to shake the curls. Shake it and shake it and shake it until you get the desired effect. And it's that simple guys thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like share and subscribe are you guys guilty of overusing hot tools to curl your hair using hot tools may cause dryness to the hair may cause roughness to the hair may cause split ends to the hair as well as break the hair easily so today i'm going to show you a method 
that does not require any heat and it's going to give you a very similar effect to a curling iron. Hi guys, my name is Rahila Ramdani. I am here back again with another YouTube video. This is a DIY video that I am making to show you how to do overnight curls. I have done two other videos on my channel concerning this topic. Since you guys had so many good things to say about it, I decided to come up with another idea for you guys on how to do overnight curls. So guys, all you need is your hair to be a little damp. Spray some water into your hair and you're just going to run your hairbrush through your hair taking out all the nuts from your hair so that it's easy to use. Next what you're going to do is section your hair into a center part and you're going to tie up one side of the hair so it's easier for you to work with just one side. After you are done with that, you're just going to partition the hair that you have, twist it and tie it up with the bobby pin. So you're going to twist, twist, twist and tie it up with the bobby pin. So once you're done with the one side of your hair, you're going to hop onto the next side and you're going to keep doing the same thing. Twist, tie up with the bobby pin. Twist your hair and tie it up with the bobby pin. Once you're done with that, you're going to go to bed. So guys, when I woke up in the morning, I went straight into the shower and thereafter I decided to just open my curls. I've expected it to be a lot more tighter than what it was. I expected a lot more bounce in the hair, but because I think I used hair that was fresh out of the shower, I, I think I used hair that was too fresh for this. You guys can give it a try and let me know in the comments section down below. Guys, that is it for me today. All I'd like to say is please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. Please turn on your post notifications so every time I post you guys can get a notification. Thank you so much for watching.
Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Heatless Curls. Today I'm doing peg heatless curls. As you can see, this took me a really long time to get right. You can use any type of pegs, just do not use the wooden ones. I use them and they really hurt throughout the night. So guys, this is my comedy of errors. I decided to put it at the beginning so you guys know that this is not an easy method and this is not something that I would be doing again. This is just something for you guys to laugh about. So hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I am going to be showing you how to do heatless curls with just pigs. Now this method really took out a lot of my hair so I don't suggest you guys try it but if you do have any plastic pegs lying around then that's a good idea for you to be using. So guys I went in by wetting my hair first a little bit. Make sure there's no knots into your hair. Then I have to take a section and wrap it around a pig. Now I didn't know how to wrap it around a pig. There were so many methods that you can use. I don't know how to explain this but maybe if you watch this you can understand how it works. As you can see it took me a really long time to get right so I'm not a professional at this. No am I a perfectionist at this so I just don't want to give you any false information. <laughs> This is what my mom used to do when she used to wash clothes so I didn't have to walk to the pegs all the time so I just kept it on my shirt. So as you guys can see I'm going to be showing you almost every single curl that I made so you guys can probably see and try and get the hang of it but please guys do not use wooden pegs I could not even sleep at night plus it was pulling my hair throughout the night there are other methods of heatless curls that I have done before I will definitely link that all down in the description box below but those methods are much easier and they don't even pain or hurt at night nor do you feel like there's anything in your hair what was irritating me was that it takes so much time to wrap your hair around this bag and it's just so easy for it to just come out and open. So guys, I'm just going to stop talking and let you watch the video. I'm going to play you guys some music in the background or just increase the volume so you guys can sit back and enjoy. On that note guys, please don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. I'm on the road to a thousand subscribers and if you guys hit that subscribe button, it will really, really, really help me out.
morning, beautiful people. Now, I put this into my head because at night, I couldn't sleep. These pigs were hurting me. So, now it's time for the big reveal. Let's see if this actually worked. Now, I'm going to put my glasses on because I really cannot see. So, I'm going to be facing this way because my mirror is here. other methods that I can use that's not going to pull out my hair but I just wanted to try this method out for my channel gosh the curls look really nice really volumized and I washed my hair the same day that I decided to do this curls which was yesterday so I washed my hair yesterday in the night and this actually sits really well so I like the curls but Without a doubt, I actually do like the curls, but for me to be going through all that pain just and losing hair just for curls, no. So guys, that will be it for me today. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. I am running a support channel on my channel. So what you do is I put out a video to say 
support for small youtubers and whatnot and you guys can comment you guys can like it you guys can subscribe to my channel you guys can go down in the comments and subscribe to everyone else that's there you can hit them up with comments and let them know that you subscribed and this is going to be a channel that we're all going to grow from so you can use me to grow and i don't mind i'm so open to that and i pray and hope that you guys succeed thank you so much for watching Hello there beautiful ladies. So today we're going to be doing heatless curls for short hair and I'm going to be using foil for my curls. So guys you can do this method overnight or you can just do it for like two to three hours. I've done mine for three hours. What you're going to do is just take tear a piece of foil and you're going to fold that piece of foil that you have just tore. You're going to fold that into smaller pieces and depending on the thickness that's of the curl that you want to do that's how thick you're going to make the foil so you're going to take your hair and wrap it around the piece of foil and then because the foil is flexible you're just going to turn it and you're going to grip it on the top so just tie the two ends of the foil on the top As you can see, I've already got my foil ready. So I'm just going to wrap my hair around the pieces of foil and tie them on my head. I'm just repeating the same method over and over again. Guys, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. Now I'm going to be removing the foil from my hair. So guys, after three hours, I removed the foil from my hair. You can add a little bit of hair serum onto your curls to give it that more shiny and glossy effect. And voila, your curls are done. So guys, this is what my hair looks like with the curls. Thank you so much for watching.